Hi, and welcome to the LesParis.com podcast. I'm Les. This podcast is a short daily monologue that you can listen to. Use it to practice listening to English. Use it to stimulate ideas. Use it for BGM. Well, hello again, and once again, welcome to the Les Paris podcast. It's episode 82. Yesterday's episode, we talked about airplane disasters. And today, in today's 82nd episode, I'd like to talk about volcanic eruptions. Volcanic eruptions. You know, the things that go boom. The big fiery mountains. Well, that's not so simple. Volcanoes are not just all volcanoes. You see, there's different types of volcanoes. Some volcanoes really go boom. Some have a mixture of boom and bubble bubble. And some just go bubble bubble. The volcanoes in, uh, where is that? Hawaii. Mostly they go bubble bubble. That means that they have volcanic eruptions where the lava comes oozing slowly out of the mountain. It doesn't move at the speed of a freight train. On the other hand, if you go over to Indonesia, those mountains, those volcanoes go boom, and they really boom. And the higher, uh, hot, fiery stuff comes out of the mountain in an explosion. And then it races down the mountainside faster than a freight train just destroying everything in its path. Some of those explosions are truly tremendous, and they can be heard around, across an ocean. And then there's kind of the squirty type. There's a beautiful volcano in Italy that makes what they call a stromboli uh, eruption. And that means the lava gets squeezed and squirted out, and you get these giant fountains of red-hot magma streaming into the air. And it looks like a water fountain, only it's molten rock. And it's very beautiful at night. I've seen photos of it. I'd like to go see it in real in person. You see, when I grew up, I was living in Canada, far, far from any volcanoes. The nearest volcano was down in America at Mount St. Helens, which also erupted. But it was far from us. So my ideas about volcanoes are romantic and exciting, and I'm quite interested in them. On the other hand, people who live close to volcanoes don't share my feelings, I think. How about you? How do you feel about volcanic eruptions? Now we've come to the end of episode 82 of the Les Paris podcast. Today we talked about volcanic eruptions and kind of different kinds. I used some colorful words to explain about them. Tomorrow, be sure to come back again and listen as I talk about whales. <laughs>